currently this is what's happening right now welcome to friday by the way check out these shoes what do you think they look hot pink and um the camera but they are actually a, like a purple here i can show you so that is a hot pink and then you can see that these are purple but let me know if i should keep them because i think i don't know if i'm gonna get a lot of use out of them so i might return these and guys this is one of my first chanel purchases actually this is my first chanel purchase it's a chanel boy i, I think you would just consider this vintage now but what really really drew me to this one was the braiding because i've never seen the braiding and the lilac and lilac is so big this year so i'm so happy that i bought this and i never got rid of it and now i am just getting ready to go so i'm just packing one of the last things I need to do is go get waxed and then I am going to finalize all my packing and relax for a little bit and it's one of my good friend's birthday parties. I'm going to go say hi to her and then come home and go to sleep because I have to be at the airport at like 5.45 tomorrow. Um, I don't know why I do this to myself every time. I'm like, oh yeah, early morning flights are the best. I like getting there early, but now I'm just like, I wish I hadn't done that, but it is what it is. Okay, here are some quick packing tips. So whenever I travel, I always obviously put all my shoes and if I can fit all my toiletries on one side and then I put all my clothes on one side. And because I'm only going for four days, I don't need to roll my clothes because there's plenty of space in here. I always like to pack light because I don't like to overpack. It gives me so much anxiety. But one of the things that I do, I have these two cloth bags that I put underneath all of my stuff so that I can put my dirty laundry in there. And then once, um, once I start having dirty clothes, I start putting all the dirty clothes here and then moving the shoes to the cleaner side. Another way I like to make sure that I'm not forgetting anything is before I put anything in my bag. By the way, how cute is this bag? I love it because it's so big. It pretty much fits all my full-size items. And obviously, like I said, I'm a minimalist. So I don't like to keep too many things on me when I travel. So really, I have my body lotion. This is the best body lotion I have ever, ever used. And trust me, I have used so many, I can't even tell you but nothing compares to this. Nothing absorbs as well as this one and nothing makes my skin feel as good. Like I think I've been using this for about eight or 10 years now and I cannot get enough of it. It's so cheap, it's available at any pharmacy. You need to try this. Okay, so this is cocoa butter. It goes in here and then I go um, like step wise. So my step one is obviously face wash and my Fourier brush so that goes in there next i use acne cream which is a dermatologist prescribed one so this goes in here my serum from neostrata which i am loving these days there we go it is the tri therapy lifting serum this has been so good i've been using it for a while sorry it's like way too bright in here and then i've potted a little bit of my sunday riley um, face lotion in here and it's also mixed in with my sunscreen and that way I don't have to have two pots of anything which I think is really good because I mean I mix it anyways when I put it on my face and then I have my toothbrush and toothpaste I need to put my toothbrush in a Ziploc bag and my deodorant I know I should not be using this deodorant I need to find a good natural one but I just haven't been able to find one. If you know of a deodorant or a natural deodorant that doesn't make you stink, please let me know. This is a brand new bottle of Hermes Twilly. If you haven't smelled this, you guys, you need to smell it. It's amazing. For eye cream, I have the Le Mer Eye Concentrate. I've probably used, this is my third pot of this. Love it. And that's it. And then my makeup bag is done. For shampoo and conditioner because we're staying at an airbnb i just packed these lilabo ones and and i've put my toiletries bag in here and then i have a hairspray a texturizing spray um 
and this Bumble and Bumble hairdresser invisible oil. This is actually really good because it is a heat protectant and it soothes any kind of fizz and not fizz, <laughs> frizz. Um, and then I just have some medicine like Advil, Dramamine I need to put in my carry-on and I have an inhaler which I don't really use a lot but just in case. I have a mini wet brush because I, I don't need like a full-sized one. I'm fine with this one. And then my uh, straightener will go in here and then I need to zip it up. The saddest part about leaving is leaving this guy. He doesn't care for me right now. Okay, bye. So in a separate packing cube, I pack all my underwear, swimsuits, socks. I have some ankle socks, some regular socks. Always carry a pair of fuzzy socks with me. My favorite place to get fuzzy socks are Old Navy. And I like to wear them around the house because I don't like to be barefoot. And then I have this Hollywood fashion tape that I take with me um, in case I ever need it. So yeah, that will go on the clothes side. Oh yeah, vlogger style. It's happening. Good morning. <laughs> oh my god, probably, morning. what is it? What is it, like 4 or 5 o'clock in the morning? 5, five, five o'clock in the morning. Okay. Wait, let me check. Let me check. Let me check. <laughs> what time is it? The watch that doesn't work. <laughs> We've just been giggling on the plane by ourselves well, forever. We've been up since 3.30. So. Yeah, these are the delirious giggles, that's for sure. But look at this. We have a seat to Sorry, the seat is taken. Picking up our car with Lexus. It is the LC500. Look how awesome this car looks. Hey, Kiara. <laughs> We're getting ready to drive. Yes. I can't wait to take this baby out to Palm Springs. This is our little view from the balcony. We are very close to the beach and we have like a little deck area and then you walk in here and here is a little living room, a kitchen, dining room and two beds and then you walk in here and this is what the kitchen looks like. It's fully equipped and that is our bathroom. I know me. 